Huzima Kutbuddin, who claimed the Wudi Baro leadership, passes away. Huzima Kutbuddin, who had been claiming succession to the position of Dai al Mutlaq of the Wudi Baro since the death of late Sidna Muhammad Burhanuddin, breathed his last in California, U.S., Thursday. According to close relatives, he had been ill for some time. Our beloved father has passed away to the highest echelons of Janat, said his son. Kutbuddin had challenged succession of Saidna Mufidil Saifuddin, son of the late Dai, as the 53rd Dai of Dawoodi Baras. In January 2014, he had claimed to be the successor to his half-brother Saidna Burhanuddin after his death claiming that the latter had conferred Nas, announcement of successor, onto him. Burhanuddin's son Mufidil, too, made a similar claim for himself and has been largely followed as the Dai of the small-knit community. Kutbuddin, who is followed by a small section of Dawoodi Baras, had reportedly decided to be succeeded by his son Tahir Fakhruddin. In a statement, Kutbuddin's family confirmed, Saidna Kutbuddin R.A. personally prepared his beloved son and made him like him in knowledge and character. This year on the 27th of Muharram, the Uris Mubarak of Saidi Fakhruddin Shahid R.A., Saidna Kutbuddin R.A. appointed Saidna Tahir as his successor and granted him the Lakab Fakhruddin. The family of the late 52nd Dai Burhanuddin has been involved in a controversy with the fight between his half-brother Kutbuddin and son Mufidil for the next Dai's position. Kutbuddin had shifted to a house in Thane soon after his half-brother's death, while his son continued to live at the massive Malabar Hills house. Both the families have also been involved in a legal battle over the guardianship of children in the family.